Good afternoon, I'm Alicia Smith and here are your headlines from 7 Action News. We are following an investigation into an attempted abduction. This happened in e-course around 3 o'clock Wednesday morning in the area of Southfield Road and 5th Street. Police have been looking for a white Chrysler town and country van. A man accused of murdering a woman and setting her Waterford Township home on fire is now headed to trial. Adonis Wilson is accused of murdering 54-year-old Stephanie Steinberg last August. Steinberg was found dead after a fire at her home on Lynn Street in Waterford Township. Prosecutors claim witnesses saw Wilson at Steinberg's home around the time of that fire. The House Appropriations Committee is holding a hearing to get answers on the response from the state on the Green Ooze disaster on I-696 in Madison Heights. That story made national headlines when the hazardous waste containing poisonous hexavalent chromium started leaking onto 696. Gary Sayers owns the site where the ooze was coming from in Madison Heights, as well as the location that's being investigated in Detroit. He's currently serving a year in federal prison for storing hazardous waste. Time to take a look at your forecast with 7 First Alert meteorologist Hallie Vogel. First we'll see more cloud cover and then eventually the chance for a few rain showers after about 3 o'clock this afternoon into the evening drive. North of I-69, more of a mix or snow showers. Temperatures well above freezing, uh, near or just above 40 degrees. We'll drop into the upper 20s tonight with the rain ending. A few snow showers lingering north of the city. You may find a few slick spots and then temperatures really take a dive for Thursday. Tomorrow, windy, cold, 31, lake effect snow showers and then and the big story headlines the winter storm for the weekend snow changing to rain, maybe a mix in between and then falling temperatures cold and slick on Sunday. Alicia. Thank you very much, Allie. Bon Jovi will be rocking Little Caesars Arena this summer. The band announced their 2020 tour with Brian Adams. Bon Jovi is known for hits like Living on a Prayer and Wanted, Dead or Alive. Their concert here in the Motor City will be on Sunday, July 19th. Tickets go on sale next Friday, January 24th at 10 a.m. Those are your headlines. Don't forget, you can get news anytime at WXYZ.com. And if you download our free 7 app, news anytime as well. I'm Alicia Smith. Have a great Wednesday.